Core Reporters, Kale and Chris are at it again. Over the weekend, Kale had been posting all these new curly hair products that she had bought to try out on her on their son Creed's hair uh, when he would come back from Chris's house on the weekend. But what did Chris do? Shady, petty Chris, who is just as messy as Kale is, who loves to play victim to Kale, he decided to hack off Creed's hair. And I say hack off because he didn't even properly cut the boy's hair. It was very patchy and not well done. So it seemed more like a spite haircut than, you know, him actually wanting to cut the hair and style it properly. So um, this is not the first time that Chris has done something like this to Kale, you know, um, cutting one of the boy's hair with, without, you know, talking to her about it first or anything like that. So so, you know, obviously the teen mom world went crazy over it. They were like, how the heck can you do this again? Kale caught a charge the first time you did it because she allegedly went over to your mama's house and Molly whooped you for doing this to the child. So why would you go ahead and do it again unless you're trying to get her to catch a second case over this situation? Listen, Chris is a mess. We all know that at this point. Um, it's just sad to watch it play out and, you know, him use his child as a pawn in his hatred for the child's mother. So far, Kale has not yet released any kind of statement. She hasn't like, you know, posted any kind of shade, like indirect statements about the situation. So maybe she learned her lesson from the last time and she's going to be taking the high road this time. Listen, it's just hair, it'll grow back and it'll grow back stronger than ever, I guess. I don't know, hopefully, right? I'm trying to be optimistic here. Um, so hopefully she just keeps it civil with him and doesn't get into any trouble because that is exactly what Chris wants. Chris wants the negative attention because when he posted online about Creed's haircut, he used a song um, by Eminem called Would the Real Slim Shady Please Stand Up? You know, which to me seemed like he was directly taunting Kale in, you know, the whole haircut situation. But I digress. As usual, I'm more interested in hearing what you have to say about the situation. So please make sure to leave all of your thoughts and opinions in the comment section below and we'll chat. That's all for now. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.